Hello everyone, I'm Isana. My background is medical doctor from Indonesia and I'm part of Opera Indonesia based in Oxford. And now I'm second year medical student and my project will about investigating the role of gamma delta T cell in the susceptibility to infection and disease outcome in individuals with type 2 diabetes. So the number of diabetes is uh, increasing and it's based on International Diabetes Federation. The number will increase until 46% in the next two decades. And most of the case will happen in the limited settings. And in that area, the number of infectious diseases is high prevalence, such as tuberculosis and myeloidosis. And also during the pandemic, diabetes is one of the risk factor to get the severe COVID-19 and break to infection. And previous findings also show that neutrophil to delta-2 lymphocyte ratio is a better prognosis marker to predict severity of COVID-19 compared to the conventional use neutrophil to CD8 T cell ratio. That's why I'm interested to explore more the role of gamma delta T cells in the diabetes mellitus. So what is gamma delta T cell? This is the unconventional T cell that can act as the bridging immunity between innate to adaptive. So innate is when the immune response acts in the early time, which is non-specific, and then later it develops to the adaptive immunity, which is protect in the longer time. And gamma delta T cell can bridging uh, by orchestrating the immune response from the beginnings of infection by producing pro-inflammatory cytokines, and then it's helping to create the memory cell which, which can uh, provide longer protection. And usually it could be recalled by vaccinations. And in the blood, the majority of the subset of gamma delta T cell is gamma 9 and delta 2. That's why I will focus more to exploring this subset of, of cells. Then um, in the first year of DEVIL, I tried to investigate the function of gamma delta T cell in DM compared to non-DM patient. And then in the next uh, time, uh, I plan to investigate the function in acute myeloidosis and acute COVID-19 patient with and without DM. And then I try to investigate the crosstalk between the cell and the other immune cell, and also its correlation with the disease severity and disease outcome. So hopefully uh, my research could help in the developing uh, vaccination strategy in vulnerable populations such as diabetes mellitus. 